You and I, I don't have any celebrity friends except you. Wait a second, Lil Twist? Are you two fighting again? <laughs> <laughs> Lil Twist and I aren't friends, we're, ch we're acquaintances. So sorry for not understanding yeah. the distinction in, yeah. in Conan speak. Uh, he and Lil Twist just play squash together, yeah, exactly. that's all. Well, yeah, but still, that's a friendship. Yeah, I guess. Because there's always a shower that follows. <laughs> 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 well, I'm just saying, he's your buddy. Yeah, he's my chum. Yeah. But you and I are good, good pals, aren't we, Marty? Conan. <laughs> yes. No, of course, we are great friends. In fact, I was at your Christmas party, very hip Christmas party. It was a good, it was a nice Christmas party. It was had. fantastic. He is, he's this, it's unbelievable how big your house is. He is so rich, Conan. Is it? <laughs> no. <laughs> the, the, nice the, the Nevada cattle guy, you know, who, who was ripping off the government, he would have, his, his cattle would have felt, finally we have some room in your backyard. <laughs> you, have, you have an endless amount of... I have a nice and you yard. Walk through, and everyone who's been to Conan's house always feels the same thing. How many portraits can a man sit for? <laughs> <laughs> I just, I, I, I love them. I love, I'm just fat. I love portraits of myself yeah. in my home. But I, but I did, I, it, this is, now this is true. I went there and I did a joke that you took all the wrong way. And all I said was, because it is a shockingly beautiful home. And I kept saying, it's astounding how big this house is, given the talent. And then I... <laughs> <laughs> But I wasn't allowed to finish my thought. He did say that. He came in and said that. <laughs> and I said, no, 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 but I didn't mean it that way. And then he said, well, how else do you mean it? Yeah. And I realized there was no other way. <laughs> Yourself in a no corner. other way. I have repeated that to everybody yeah. I run into. That's and then, I'm... and then you came to my. I had a, a, an Oscar party. Yes. And you were uh, uh, lovely. Uh, you and the beautiful Liza, who phones every night around 3 a.m. because I know the slur. And she. Uh, <laughs> You're hello. saying my wife calls you drunk at 3 a.m. Uh, yeah. <laughs> And then, and then I was going to just watch it, you know, with a bunch of people. Hi, Marty. Yeah. Okay. I'm a prisoner in a golden cage. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, and then we went to the Vanity Fair party. You talked me into it. I went yeah. upstairs. You were going to go, and I said, nope. we got to go to this yep. thing. And I can't go alone. They don't want to see me. They want to see you. No, 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 no. They, no, no, they, no, 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 no. But they get very excited when you walk in. Uh -huh. They do. Don't you think? No. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, no. I thought, I listen, I, you, you talked to everyone there. I was talking, I had this fantastic conversation with Steven Tyler for five, ten minutes, and then I didn't have my lenses, and I realized I was talking to an old janitor's broom, and <laughs> I felt so good. <laughs> Why are you with that idiot. room? <laughs> I know. Well, now you know. But oddly enough, he got an autograph. Yeah, he did get it. <laughs> from the room. And a splinter.